four. Hello and welcome to the React channel. I'm Von Stencil Crumb, but you can call me Jordan. And today, I'm jumping back into Nightwish. I'm looking forward to this. It's been about six, seven weeks since my last uh, film session. And the reason it's been so long is I think I've filmed about 12 to 15 videos and one got pushed through. The rest were copyright striked, tried to claim fair use and all that jazz, but I never got any reply. Like I've, I've tried to claim fair use multiple times on one video and nothing. And escalating it to YouTube and all that jazz, but like, honestly, it's just... Uh, it's a kick in the pants, to be completely honest. It, it really takes it out of you when, you when you set aside just all this time to be able to do it. You go through the the editing process, you, you, you mix it all, you do it all, put it all together. You create it all, and then right at the very end, bang. No, can't use it. And it's, it's, it, honestly, it's kind of like a throwaway video. So, yeah, it, um, yeah, it was just, it just sucked. It just sucked and it took me out of it and it, it made it not fun, which the, the whole reason is I, I want to have fun with this. Um, yeah, I, I don't get paid. <laughs> I, uh, I couldn't make it working with my, my real job and my life and everything else and, you know, it's uh, it's hard to do with, <laughs> with a 20-month-old toddler uh, running rampant through the house. So, anyway, enough about the 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 whinging and groaning. You guys don't care about that. You guys want to see some Nightwish. And that's what we're watching. We are watching Devil in the Deep Dark Ocean. It's live at Buenos Aires. And I'm looking forward to this. I haven't listened to him for a while now, so I'm just keen to get, hear some good fucking music so let's get into it guys click all the buttons down below you know what to do it's youtube let's just jump straight in let's go okay so we'll give you this nice Marco. devil and the deep dark ocean cool. Ooh. Ooh. this is oh go ahead poo. Oh god! <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is already cool. Ooh. I like that double kick. Oh man, this would be so fun to play on the drums. I, like, I know it sounds just like it's a, um, a double kick heavy song, and, and it probably is. Um, oh, this is, I don't know, there's, so, there's something so pumpy and upbeat about this song. It's just, I think if you play this, whether it's bass, piano, or keys, uh, drums, or guitar, or even singing, this just sings like a song. You'd be, you'd be so pumped and ha like you, you couldn't perform without a smile on your face. Is what I'm saying. <laughs> this, this sounds like an. Oh man, this sounds so fun. <laughs> oh, what a fade out. That's brilliant. I would die for 
<laughs> Ooh, key change, okay. Oh, I miss these guys. So cool. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, this is such a bitchin' song. I love this song. This is really, really, really cool. This is, it feels so creative and just free. Like, it, it just seems like everyone's just having like a free, fun, Sesh. It's like, all right, guys, we're playing in this key. Go for it. <laughs> oh, man. One of the things I really, really like about uh, Nightwish songs when it's got Marco and Floor singing, it's just like these two opposites, but together it sounds beautiful. And when I say opposites, it's like Marco's voice is this earthy growl. Like, you feel like it's... It's uh, coming from a Viking king. Like, it's just... Um, it's commanding. It's powerful. It, it really... It's like you stand on attention when you hear his voice. And then with Floor's voice, it's this otherworldly sound. It, she sounds like she's doesn't belong on Earth. She sounds like she's this angel or... You listen and it feels like you, you're you drifting off into another dimension or reality. It's it's like one grounds you and really like makes you uh, pay attention or it commands your attention. And this other one wants to take you away. And it's together. <laughs> it really, it's just like, wow, these, these kind of voices shouldn't work, but they work because you've got this epic music in the background that uh, are very similar you've got the the um the guitar the drums and the bass very ground uh, grounding kind of music very um you know it's like yeah like it makes you have a time and you stick to it and it's like marching kind of thing or it's it's really like Urgh! and then you've got to mass on the the keys where he can just make anything sound epic <laughs> and it can and with uh, the keys and floor it's just this whole other experience so in, in this song I don't know why it feels like it's it's the perfect combination like they've done this in other songs but with this one it's just it, for me it feels like they absolutely nailed this um, give and pull uh, yin and yang um balance it's just it it feels like the perfect balanced song by these guys it is amazing Go to Mars. <laughs> From cradle to coffin, shall my wickedness be your passion? <laughs> 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 
That was great. Oh, uh, Troy! <laughs> I was thinking, that doesn't sound like Tomas on the guitar. That was you so, so good. Whew, wow. What a song. That that has skyrocketed to one of my favourite Nightwish songs. Um, that just... Wow. I really liked that bit at the end. It's It was like this transition where uh, Marco, he really like sells the that moment where he's like, I am the devil kind of kind of moment and then from there the song kind of transitions into a lot more of a, a soft metal or like a, a rock instead of the the you know the the double kicks and the aggressive playing and like speed metal kind of <laughs> moment it kind of um the tempo really 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 gets pulled back and it kind of transitions into this other song within the song which is beautiful. They do it so well. They're one of the best bands that I know that can transition so seamlessly with their key changes, their tempos, timing, all, all these things. They they do it perfect. And it's a credit to Tomas. He, he, he knows how to make it work. And um, yeah, he really makes it work for this one. I loved this song. This is such a great song. Uh, it just feels fun, it's vibrant, it's like in your face, it's hard, it's got great uh, music showmanship where these guys are just doing their thing and then you've got moments where it's floor just showcasing a couple of notes. And, but she does like a note so well. <laughs> I, I don't know why I should be surprised at this because this is what they do. They create amazing music that's what they do like i shouldn't be surprised i shouldn't be surprised at all ah oh, feels good to listen to these guys again and and to do this man i'm keen i am so keen now this is hyped me up this really hyped me up i hope you guys enjoyed the video as much as i did uh click all the buttons down below leave a comment all that jazz yada 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 hit me up with suggestions and guys it's good to see you again and I hope to see you on the next one. Peace.